Yo, what's going on, you guys? It's Tavius, and we're back with another video. Here we are with the character overviews, baby. We're gonna be looking at JP. My dude looks like gonna be a zoning monster with psycho power. Check out the last ones. We got more. Let's go. That super is already controversial with this outfit. Golly. I'm excited to share with you. Gosh, this guy looks One like he's gonna be something. Be he's a set play character. Kaido. Drop Jamie, bro. Pick up this guy, bro. Knock someone down and you set this up? Characters oh, yeah, it's going to be. And then do that? Oh, yeah, it's going to be crazy. Rumbling. He's just Street, he's street Fighter Jeff Merlin. You can immediately tell that the screen control and trap setups are so real with JP. Ah, leave. He dominates the neutral with tons of projectiles. The crazy part here is that they're not telling you, like they showed you in the Manon overview, that Manon could just spin through all of these, bro. <laughs> ah, I love it. Manon is spinning through all of that. You got to think about that, JP. Don't throw those fireballs at me when I'm playing her. I'm spinning. The trap special is similar to C Viper's Seismo in Street Fighter 4, causing thorns to rise up from the ground. To oh my god. Uh... Fireball, for example. Strieborg appears to be a combo ender or poke special with JP swinging his staff to push away opponents. Departure. Jesus Christ, that this dude is about to be a zoning demon, bro. He's the king of social distance, bro. He does not want to be close. Six feet or more. He said we're in 2023. Social distance jokes are outdated. My bad. Departure causes a portal to appear in the air, which summons thorns to catch the opponent off guard. The also setups for that are going to be crazy. Follow. Quarter circle back and light your medium punch teleports JP to the portal, allowing you to escape from opponents or immediately pressure with jump attacks. Pretty scary, right? Ports oh, yeah. And heavy punch forces That's sand. To right away. The trickery on this character knows no bounds. Amnesia is JP's counter move, which strikes the opponent back and implants them with a psycho power infused bomb, which is a nod to Bison's V Trigger 2 in Street Fighter 5. Now, just mm, trying to think of mm, all those crazy mm. pressure setups you can get with this. Torbalan sends a. That was disgusting. Golly, oh, we're here for Street Fighter 6, but that was nasty. And you can also faint this by holding it for extreme mind games. And finally, Embrace looks similar oh my to his God. projectile, but it's a full screen command grab. Yes, you heard that correctly. It's a man grab from full screen? I'm not holding hey, those. I'm not. Thank goodness the audio cue and animation is slightly different. <laughs> Beard is literally like this, coming at you, about to smoke you. He's like, come here, <laughs> bruh. The audio cue and animation is slightly different here. Okay, yeah. The command grab is close hand, close to the screen. The regular one is the other hand that's away from the screen. It also has a bunch of unique command attacks and target combos, most notably his heavy kick, heavy punch string. Oh my god, was that a low? Says, which I'll go over in a moment. His Ah, I wonder how minus that was. That's plus three on hit. I wonder what it's on Level block. one super is a full screen projectile blast, which acts pretty similar to Jury's level one. His level two is where it gets tricky. A series of psycho power projectiles spawn around. Oh my god. So, uh, this could mean you could get crazy combo potential with this, or better yet, some scary resets and pressure. Perhaps you could use those target combos I just mentioned. That plus? Scary resets and pressure. Perhaps you could use. That looks plus as freak, bro. Those target. I don't know. That jump look plus is free. I'm not pressing there. Oh, and I wasn't ready for how sick his level three is. It combos from full screen with ease. Interesting. Also <laughs> that was a controversial frame right there. <laughs> controversial frame. Can <laughs> if you know, you know. It's insanely strong. When this guy has three bars, you better not press anything. Oh my goodness. I also did some pretty crazy anti air conversions, as you can see right here. Off of what? I also discovered some pretty crazy anti air conversions. Dang. Dan Roundhouse. Versions, as you can see right here. Oh man. That's a lot of damage for Overall, an anti or golly. Like he is going to be one of the most loved SF6 characters. Not only does he look ridiculous, but his tool set looks amazing to counter slow characters and dominate the entire screen. He might be lacking in defensive options opposed to other characters and may suffer against faster rushdown types, but don't let that put you off this incredible yet technical newcomer to the Street Fighter franchise. Oh yeah, JP's going to be cooking people from full screen for breakfast, bro. That just going to be crazy all that all them setups that dude got crazy that's a lot bro all right you guys that's gonna be it for jp check out the other ones in the top right corner jp looks like a menace he's also looks like he's gonna be really good a lot of characters in this game look like they're pretty good people are gonna find setups and everything it's been tavius i will see you guys in the next video catch you guys next time and we out of here baby peace